most of the people in the country are going to the Trump rally right now because he's listening to them. No one's asking about this stuff. I'm just frustrated. I hope you understand why I'm getting tired of it. You're doing your jobs, but you're not asking the questions that Americans give a shit about. Yeah, and there is a reason why everyone following Trump says, well, he listens to me and I will listen to him. You could put half of Trump supporters into what I call the basket of deplorables. Credulous boomer rube demo that backs Donald Trump um, that, that wants to think that, <laughs> that, that Donald Trump's a smart one and they're oh, y'all, y'all, y'all elitists are them. <laughs> <laughs> you you elite us with your geography and your maps and your spelling, even though my your math and your reading. <laughs> Maybe there needs to be a formal deprogramming of the cult members, but something needs to happen. You're going to have rural people out there voting their craziness about the cult. We are worried about potential rise of fascism in this country. The leader who is trying to do that is part of that equation. Mm -hmm. But people wanting that Correct. is a yeah. much mm -hmm. bigger part mm -hmm. of that That's equation. Right. Trump and his MAGA supporters not only embrace political violence, but they laugh about it. I got to tell you guys, I went to a Donald Trump rally a couple nights ago. Never been to one. Uh, I had an event across the street. I saw the line of people waiting in the cold for hours. And I thought, what the heck? You know, I'm going to be a leader who actually invites people, doesn't condemn them. Met probably 50 Trump people waiting in line. Every single one of them, thoughtful, hospitable, friendly. All of them so frustrated that they feel nobody's listening to them but Donald Trump. A diverse crowd, people who had never been to a Trump event before. My party is completely delusional. Tudor, truer words never spoken. And the only thing, the only qualifier to this is it makes me a little sad that, that he had to just talk directly to Trump voters to see, oh my gosh, they're just like us. Of course <laughs> they are. Because we are all Americans and we are all facing the same issues. And those guys are facing the singular issue of not being listened to except for by one candidate. But this, this message of MAGA extremist has painted an entire 75 million people as these crazy people, right? And, and Kaylee knows I used to be the person in line with all of those folks interviewing people. And he's exactly right. Diverse group, dedicated dedicated to the country, not just dedicated to Trump. That's what people think. These are people who are just love Trump. No, they love America. I've been when it's been below zero. I've been when it's been 100 degrees. They are dedicated because they feel like this country needs to be brought back. And that's what he saw. He saw genuinely loving people. And I love that he went out there and said that. And I think CNN was probably like, uh-oh. <laughs>